welcome to Glycon. Glycon is a motion capture system that uses VR equipment to perform motion capture. It's really easy to use. So I've got on a headset right now, and I've got uh, hand trackers. I'm using Vive Wands, and that's it. There's nothing else I'm using here. And so I'm going to show you how easy it is to take that uh, motion capture data and then throw that straight into Unreal. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to pop open the HUD by pushing a lower button on either controller. And that's going to look like this. And from here, I'm going to go down to Recording, at the Recording section, and choose Target Platform. And I'm, then I'm going to choose the Unreal Engine here. Now I can choose another one, Unity, iClone, Blender, ARP, DAS, 3ds Max, but I'm going to choose Unreal in this case. And I'm going to hide the uh, menu by pushing the bottom button again. And at this point, I'm going to hit the top button on the controller. The top button will allow me to start recording, and anything I do at this point is now going to be recorded. So let me show you what that looks like in third person. This is me. I'm acting out a scene, or I'm, I'm acting out something. As you can tell, I only have um, a hand controllers and a headset on, but I'm, it's doing full body simulation. So I can move around all I want, and it's going to try to simulate what my body would be doing at that time. And so when I'm done with this, I can take this in and apply it directly to uh, the skeleton in Unreal. Uh, in this case, a man the mannequin skeleton. So I've been recording this whole time. I'm going to hit the top button again. And you'll notice when I do that, that this sign up here is going to start, is going to say, uh, finished recording. And over here, this red button is going to turn back to a different color to indicate that it is now finished exporting that. And it'll say, finished FDX export right up there at the top. Okay, so we finished that. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to, I'm going to hop over to my um, computer that's right here. I'm not, I don't have to open a third party app or download anything or anything like that. It's all contained on the computer and, and written out immediately. So all I have to do now is just literally sit down with the computer and open Unreal and open a file browser and that's it. So let me show you what that looks like. Here we go. So on the desktop, there'll be a folder called Glycon Files and we're going to open up uh, Unreal. And we have a mannequin in there right now and it uses the mannequin skeleton. So anything that'll work with a mannequin will work with this. And we're just gonna drag our FBX file into Unreal. At this point, it's going to automatically sense that it's mannequin based and it's gonna select that and we'll say import all. It may give us some errors here and we're just going to on the import and we're just gonna ignore them basically. Uh, and that's it. So here is our animation. Ah, here is our animation. Okay, there we go. So as you can see, it's doing full body simulation. It's completely rigged the entire body and it has uh, applied all of this animation to the entire body. And that's it. And so we have our entire animation right there. And if I was wearing a foot, foot trackers and hip tracker, uh, pelvis tracker, it would record those two. And that's all it takes. So now we have that FBX uh, recorded out and that's all it takes to get it into Unreal. So this is in version 77 beta 5. We have the new Unreal exporter and uh, I can't wait to see what you guys do with it. For more information, go to glycon3d.com and pick up a copy. Thanks. Have a great day.